well, well, Longford, you've been dirty bastards already. Already in the bathroom already. I'm only after hearing somebody's been cheating on his wife. How fucking oh, that is disgusting. The stuff you heard, and I was just taking a piss. That was the longest piss I've ever had in my life, though. But there was so much information I could tell you. I was like a school girl on Christmas Day. I was like, oh, come on, tell me what? Come on, tell me, tell me. And then the next thing, the other girl's pregnant. Imagine. Imagine you've just ruined your life. I don't care. Well, that went down like a lead balloon, so I'm going to tell a shit joke, all right, lads? <laughs> Thank you. One or two? Pick a number. Two. two. Uh, why did the hand cross the road? To get to the second hand shop. <laughs> you can do this if you want, I don't mind. <laughs> I've got nine and a half minutes, I don't mind. I can hand the microphone to you, mate. The second joke is what's Forrest Gump's Facebook password? One Forest One. <laughs> I might as well quit while I'm ahead and just walk off right now, you know? But I came here with a set, and I might as well say it anyway. Sorry. So who works in retail here? Yeah. And who works in a call center? Nobody. I know Alex does, actually. He's one of the acts here tonight, right? He works in a call center. He's the luckiest chap here alive. Because if anybody knows, if anybody works in retail, we have to put up with a lot of shit. Yeah. We have to put up. We're basically marriage counselors, aren't we? Yeah. We're basically marriage counselors because we, we deal with, like, I work in a retail, right? And I had two couples, well, not two couples, sorry, two people there arguing in front of me. And I'm just going there. Yeah, um, there's, a, there's a bathroom there. You've had about five minutes. And I'll keep this transaction on hold if you want to. Like, I don't mind. Like, you just, like, come on in there and just have it out. Like, but, like, with call centers, if you have a problem on a, like, a phone, and say, like, if an elderly woman calls up and says, like, oh, my car's broke down, and all like that. And you're like, yeah, we can send out help, and all like that. You can hang up. Hang up and say, uh, who's that? I don't know, I don't know, who's that? I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to sit down, is that all right? Oh, no, grand. Now, probably from telling from Max, I'm from Dublin, all right? <laughs> I'm just getting the biggest pops from saying Dublin and all random shit, like, no, no, you don't, stop lying. <laughs> but with, um, You've all probably seen what Dublin mothers are like, have you? Yeah. Well, I live at one, so, right? so this is what I... <laughs> so I'm going to tell you like, what they're like, right? So basically, what, 25 years, well, I'm giving myself a year here, but like 25 years, I live with my mother, right? And it is absolutely hell, all right? From the first moment you wake up, all you hear is, Brandon, dun dun, wah, wah, wah. Did you get paid yet? Yeah? No, get paid. Then when you wake up, when you wake up and all that, you walk outside and you, it's absolutely freezing, especially in the winter. You all see it. It's fucking Baltic outside. You know what I mean? Like it's Baltic. Your ma's there, standing there at the wall with a cup of tea, wrapped up in sheep, right? Basically, with her rug boots on, with her fucking leopard print pajamas on her, talking to the next door neighbour, and she's like, "That fucking prick never got paid. He didn't. Think I can't go out now. I can't go out and get me fucking shopping and all like that." Fuck off, will you? Then you have the fucking chihuahua trying to piss on my leg. <laughs> you have the other one trying to hunt my leg. And you're, ba you're just basically fucked from the get-go, like, you know, like, like, you're supposed to be, I'm working for my mother, I'm not working for a company, do you know what I mean? Like, like <laughs> and basically when it comes around to, the, to around, what say, let's, let's give it around six o'clock, six o'clock at night. Where's the money for me, Ryan? Where, why are you doing this to me? Why, why are you doing this to me? Because, I'm not fucking doing anything. You're the one who gave birth to me. You're the one who's laid down for five minutes fucking, you know, make creating me and all like that. It's like, yeah, you're such a disappointment, aren't you? Jeez. Am I boring you? <laughs> At least you're being honest, mate. <laughs> oh, well, um, let's go on to the next one anyways, because this is fucking going down like a lead fucking balloon. Don't will me. Don't. 
Don't woo me. Don't woo me. That's, that's just, oh, just a little bit more, please. Just a little more. Just a little more. Because <laughs> I am absolutely shite tonight. After the three other acts, I am doing absolutely shite. <laughs> See, that's what I want. I want sympathy. Thank you. <laughs> no, but... Um, since uh, you probably hear from my voice, I haven't hit puberty yet. My balls haven't dropped and all like that. I'm fucked with love, basically. <laughs> Instead of asking someone out, I get the random pat on the shoulder saying, ah, oh, pet. Now, <laughs> girls, you all know when you say, ah, oh, pet, boys, we know we're fucked. <laughs> we are fucked from the get-go. We might as well stop. That's why I haven't had, like, oh, what did I say? I'm a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not a virgin. I'm not that sad. I've had, I had my fucking share, you know, you want to, oh, I've had my share. <laughs> who wants it? <laughs> now that was an actual pickup line, who wants it? <laughs> but it's like, does anybody want to kind of come up here and uh, show you my shit chat up lines? No. Yeah. Hi. Thank you. What's your name? Neve. Neve, right? So stand there. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Well, you can be my manager, please. <laughs> so one of my shit ones, sorry, Niamh, is if I was a pirate, if you were a pirate, would uh, you be on this shoulder or this shoulder? <laughs> I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. Thank you, Niamh. Can you give Niamh a round of applause, please? And as you can tell, it doesn't fucking work. <laughs> so that's why I just got home to this. So it's just, <laughs> it's the best option, you know? As you, don't, as you know, you don't get no kids, no screaming, like, uh, you're a half, sorry. I don't know why I, 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 I don't know why I blanked out for a minute. I was like, you're a half, you're a half. I just don't want to fucking slag you because I don't want a uh, screaming mothers coming up to me and going, fucking little cunt, you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want that. I like, get enough of that at home. You fucking little shit, chick, you fucking. <laughs> why are you such a fucking embarrassment? <laughs> Ma, I only asked about the Tesco offers, fuck's sake. <laughs> This is why I'm never gonna show my mother this video because the actual fact, the actual fact that I will have four, right, my mother and my three aunties, they will literally beat the bollocks out of me. They will beat the bollocks out of me. One, my auntie is nicknamed Jaws, and Jaws for a reason. You can probably all guess why. She's a 10 to test you eats the fucking all you can eat buffet. It's fucking unreal. Like it's like oh my god. I have an, another auntie, Angie's her name. She will drop her knickers just to get a taxi. Just saying. <laughs> That's the best now she I swear, right? Christmas party she was like, uh, we're all trying to get a taxi and the next thing she goes, Brendan, hold on. Seen the amount of fucking people drop in. Amount of people drop in. She goes, there you go. Learn lesson, learn to drop your cacks. <laughs> <laughs> and I won't even mention the other one. <laughs> <laughs> um, how many minutes have we all left? About now, yeah. So I'll leave you all on this, okay? I'm a diabetic, which I'm, again, God fucked me over again. I ain't got any fists that I'm in, like, jeez. If you ever see me in Dublin, just start showing sugar at me, because that's the best way you're gonna kill me, all right? Thank you, and thank you for not being so bad on me. <laughs>